First on four, as we first reported, a body has been found matching the description of missing spring breaker Justin Walker. CBS 4's Nestor Mato live on South Padre Island with more details about the discovery of the body, Nestor. Marcy, it's a devastating development for the parents of Justin Walker. A body has been found matching his description, and it comes on the same day they arrive here to South Padre Island where he was last seen. Cameron County Park Rangers say the body was found in the waters along the Playa Baghdad Beach that's on the Mexican side near Matamoros earlier today. Investigators say the body matches the description of Walker. The body even had a UME bracelet on the wrist. Of course, the 18 year old was last seen here at Schlitterbahn Water Park for the UME concert. CBS 4 spoke to John and Deborah Walker this afternoon when they arrived from San Antonio. They said they were still holding out hope. I don't want to look too no. deep. It's too scary. No. Uh, where I'm just at, he's he's partying somehow. He's with people. The parents have to go into Matamoros to identify him. Uh, we're working exactly what kind of uh, um, paperwork they're going to need to to do this to be allowed to go in there to identify him. As you heard, Walker's parents were heading to Mexico to confirm. Investigators say Walker's credit cards and phones have not been used. Since he was last seen Saturday morning, three friends say they lost contact with him. Park rangers say the body could have been swept away by the current. They tell me the Walker family is completely devastated. Now, if Walker's body is confirmed, he would be the second UME goer to die in as many years. Just last spring break, 20-year-old Jordan Britton's body was found in the grassy marsh right behind me. Live on South Padre Island, I'm Nestor Mato, CBS4 News and ValleyCentral.com.